Hello there. I just was going through. Uh, somebody had a question here. I guess when they're texturing something, um, they're going, "What is the light wave leave behind some of these points when I move geometry around in the UV projection? Uh, can they be cleaned up? What about third-party tools that you use?" Uh, I'm just going to go real quick with. I mean, I guess with my approach on how I would go about doing that, or the way I UV texture. Uh, let me just open. Uh, random object up here and uh, go through that just gonna change one of the viewports to a UV type and then uh, for instance I just want to texture the one tank or do you know each each kind of section on its own uh, so I'm just going to go select a few polys, uh, right bracket, select everything else, then then hit the equal sign button, um, drop the selection, uh, and then use your edge selection mode. F for example, I'm just going to uh, UV or unwrap it here. Uh, hit the right arrow oh, right arrow I'm holding shift here and then doing that uh, so basically just pop it open and split everything up hopefully into a nice looking uh, UV <coughs> then just go to your map here uh, ABF unwrap hit that then it automatically puts it in here under unwrapped you know, uh, channel. And I'm going to drop the selection here. Uh, and then what I normally do is, for example, try avoiding, because um, you're tempted to just, you know, oh, let me just grab whatever and start moving it around and, uh, you know, it could start glitching out on you here. Okay, so you got, you're gonna have like a random points, and then <clears throat> sometimes if you're starting to move around some of these things, um, you know, gonna have like random like connections going in to these red points, the common points. Oops, I'm just gonna redo that. Uh, but basically, what they're saying is, um, or they're suggesting to you, is that uh, if you want to delete that particular thing just hit underscore just to delete it from you know not the actual model but just from the UV uh, map only and yeah I mean we got we got our we already screwed that up here I'm just gonna delete this whole thing real quick so again underscore button you select all the points uh, just redo that real quick here. And all right, and then hit APF unwrap. Uh, but say you did want to move, you know, let's say I wanted to move. Uh, few of these polys without having this weird uh, point in in the middle All right let's say so you couldn't get away with it say okay you would just go about unwielding this whole thing so you press uh, control U in case you did you know want to move one you know one particular thing out of this whole grid without having uh, everything glitching out on you you just go 
unweld everything or go and control U to unweld everything and then you hit uh, all right so then let's say let me for example move this whole row okay so I'm just gonna go there so I'm gonna go T for move And then, and then to get back to normal, just press M. Uh, I think it's gonna have this on default, but okay. So we just merged back up to normal, and now we're, you know, we removed this thing without having any issues uh, with our with our UV. Nothing really got glitched out. And then I just normally work on uh, using you know point mode uh, just to just to avoid any kind of uh, problems with it uh, for example or you could you know just use for example polygon to select it because it's easier and then you could go selection select points now you're gonna have common points up here to select that guy there okay something like that and then and then just uh, maybe rename the your texture so rename vertex map right here and then say tank underscore top something like that uh, and then just backslash to unhide everything else and for example work on the work on the next item uh, hopefully that helps you out on how to manipulate in the UV you can zoom in I guess I forgot to mention hopefully this helps you out on your uh, on your I don't really use any plugins uh, if that's what you're looking for uh, as far as doing that I try to use like the standard U, uh, UV tools that you have here. Um, this ABF unwrap has been pretty helpful, you know, in getting just pretty much doing any kind of work in here, uh, other than like planar stuff.